With only a few weeks remaining of this year's series of Love Island, contestants are coupling up to not only find love but with the hope of getting into the final and winning their share of £50,000. And former contestant Kyna Ellis, who was in last year's show alongside Olivia Atwood and Kem Seaton A has spoken to Express.co.uk about this year's series and in particular the tests the couples are made to go through. Last week, decided to show the girls in the villa video clip, which included Jack reacting to seeing his ex Ali Jones enter Casa Amor. Discussing Donnie's emotional reaction. It's not real life, it's a reality TV show. Kyna said, that was quite mean. Obviously it's a TV show. Things do happen and when the video was shown it was all there to create drama and suspense of a TV show. If there wasn't any drama or a little bit of controversy it would be boring. Obviously it's upsetting but then again it actually tests them and shows who's genuine and who's not. And from that video we can really see Donnie is genuine about Jack. Kyna also discussed the fan favorite couple, who she believes will definitely win the show. She said, Jack and Donnie, they will win. If they get to the final and do win it, they deserve it. The former contestant also commented on how the Islanders are well taken care of, not only during their time on the show but once they have left the villa. Kyna commented, you are bombarded with press when you leave. You get to see a psychologist whilst you're on the show and when you come out you can see someone to make sure you're okay. They do have a duty of care. They handle that quite well. They do look after you when you leave and I'm sure as the years go by and everything builds up they will make sure it gets better. They give you a booklet of information as well. A spokesperson for Love Island confirmed the show takes its duty of care very seriously. We discuss with Islanders, before and after the show, how their lives might change and the difficulties they might face. They said, we direct them towards taking on professional representation after the villa and help them through this process so that they have experienced help as they face those pressures. Recently, Love Island fans saw the tension rise in the villa following Georgia Steele and Jack Fowler's kiss on their afternoon date. Jack, who was coupled up with Laura Anderson, spoke to Laura about his date with Georgia and told her about the shared kiss. However he insisted that Georgia was the one who initiated the kiss, which Laura was not impressed about. Georgia was pulled aside by Laura and asked to explain how her date went with Jack admitting that they did kiss one another. Love Island returns tonight at 9 p.m. on 2. Her admission led to one of the biggest arguments yet on the show.